Hey, this is your girl Zena with Intervision TV, and today we have a special guest, Riley here. Money count. Okay, and that's what I was gonna first ask you about. What is this whole money camp thing that you got going on here? Money camp, man, that's the movement. You know, we got loyalty, we got family, we got the bag. You know what I'm saying? So that's what we get into, all of that. Money campus, you know, we got Casey, we got Rome, you know, Afro Chapman, you know, a few others, but it's the move right here. Money camp, all day. Okay, and what, what, is, what inspired this whole money camp movement? What's Man, behind the really, it's something like that, but it's like more family than anything. You see, it's like the triangle. So we all loyal to each other. You know, and then we all family, and we just all get to the bag. You know, we got to get to it, and we got to help each other. We got to stay together. You know what I'm saying? I TV, y'all got movements. Y'all stay together. You see what I'm saying? So this is just our motto, money count. Respect that. Yeah. Okay, so with the music, what's, what's going on? What projects you got coming up? What's Man, I got a mixtape I'm working on now called No Love Loss. No Love Loss. You know what I'm saying? That's going to be coming out soon. Just check out for that. Got a couple shows coming up. You know, we got Miami in July. You know, we got uh, the 22nd, which is Friday. We got on uh, the Junction. So we just doing it big, man. Staying busy. Oh, okay. Cool. Um, any singles you going to plan on dropping? Um, we got Cake Up with me and my dog rock man mm -hmm. uh that's gonna be on the project and i got ghost mm -hmm. which is myself so that's going up right now too okay okay and what inspired you to want to do music of all the things you could have done why you chose music man to be honest like music reach everybody that's true. you see what i'm saying like it don't matter what color you are what creed you know what i'm saying where you from Everybody love music. It's it, right. Everybody love music, and I just been around it so long. With some of the people I've been around, it, it just only makes sense to do. And how'd you start? What was the start? What what made you Man, feel like I could do this? So, like some of my friends, they already, you know, my partners, they already in the industry, and I play ball. Like I hope. And, and doing that, I would go visit them in the A and, you know, we'd be around these different artists and be in different places. Right, right. And it was like, you know, you just soak up the game. So it was like, bro, you should just do it because you can do it. And I was like, man, I'll try it further. I was like, man, I'm not doing that shit. But then it came out, I tried it. Hey, it's working out. Yeah, it's, it's working out. Right? Yeah, it's man. That's cool. Okay, so back to the whole music thing and. You know, who do you see yourself working with in the future? Like, who would you like the opportunity to work with to be able to brand yourself with? I mean, to be honest, I really want to work with the partners in the city because, you know, my dog Wu just got signed. Right. 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 Um, Cocky, King Cocky, you know, I want to do something with him. And then we'll figure out the rest later, but I want to hold, you know, hold the city down. Right. Yeah, hold the city down. So we can all come up, because there's a lot of talent out here. If we just stick together, you know, we can do it. That's definitely true. Right. That's good. Keep the brotherhood, keep bring your city up. You know, you're not trying to hey. forget about where you come from, who oh, you man. are. That's always a great start. And as of right now, what what local artists are you working with? Or you just really I got, man. Rock Man, we did the Cake Up song. We pushing that real heavy. Got right. a video out on YouTube. Okay. Um, Trigger, you know, we do a lot of, we do a lot of good work together, and he got his own little movement, Contraband, but he really, he popping, he coming up in the city, um, really that's, you know, that's it, Skis, you know, he on like a Logic vibe, you know what I'm saying, but he hard, gee, man, it's just, it's a bunch of people, to be honest, like I said, it's a lot of talent, so you just trying to soak all that up, and just give it to the world now. Okay, so, Speaking on the industry and this whole music thing, you know, looking from the outside in, right. it's so easy. It looks like it just happens right. overnight. Mm -hmm. So, you know, kind of explain to me, like, what people don't get to see, the behind the scenes, was not They don't get to the see, you know, I don't think that people really get to see the grind. Like, you really grind. You start out grinding by yourself because the people around you that you know, they really ain't with it. Then, you know, once you start getting like a little buzz, now they're like, okay, yeah, now they coming around. And then when you go ahead and 
now you there or you on your way there then everybody's coming in so they don't really get to see the grind a lot of people see like the finished product right you know of course when it's out so i think that's really the struggle just playing the politics like i'm not a politic person like at all and, and it's like whether it's local whether you already made it it's it's bullshit to be honest. You know what I'm saying? So you just gotta get used to that. Cause it's not like being like a street code and you, you know what I'm saying? It's none of those ethics. Right. It's all a finesse game. Right. So you gotta play the game the right way. And it's a whole new learning process. A whole new learning process. Stepping into a whole new game. Whole new right, and you can't take it, you can't take people like so literal. Yeah. Like I, when I first started. You can't take everything to heart. Yeah, everything you can't take it to heart. Soul. Like you'll, you'll lose quick. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, you know you what I'm saying? Yeah, get feelings, stay with your feelings. Right, <laughs> right. Thing, but, that's, but that's a real, like, you like a real, like, person, like a real nigga. Like, I'm a, I don't, like, do the Instagram like that. Like, I like to pull up on people, like, talk to people face to face, hand to hand. And it's not, right. everybody ain't on that, especially, like, if you're playing the game. So that's probably, like, the biggest, man, the biggest challenge, or was the biggest challenge for me. And you just learn, you know, it's just a process, everything is a process. But the grind is the hardest thing because you're really doing it on your own until they see, you know, until they start riding, right. And the work day. Yeah, there you go. So you feel, as of right now, with, with what you're working on, with the project you work on, what you feel like is the struggles with this? What? Because this is a new step. You, you're not doing what you was doing. Right. Yeah, really so. staying in, just staying in the studio and just like getting it done because like I'm probably like oh man I got 10 other things to do over here because I'm like the like me I'm like the golden child in my family right. so I make shit run mm -hmm. so you know I'm pulled like 10 so now for them to be, they call hey man you gotta come to the studio bro and like or we lock you in right. you know what I'm saying so probably just staying in the studio and staying focused right. to this. Right. Yeah, right. Yeah. It will. Yeah. Okay. And so now being that you are looking back to where you were, what would you tell somebody that's in your that there? Or even your old self, what would you say to you? What would, what what advice would you give to you? Trust the process. Stay patient. Trust the process. Stay patient. Stay patient. Stay patient. And trust the process and stay patient. Stay patient because it'd be people that be working for you behind the scenes and you don't even know it. Right. You see what I'm saying? Like, I had people working for me and they would think they were just waiting for me to move. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So trust the process and stay consistent. And you know, people are, you know, the right people are just come to you. Right. You know, I, I feel like if you go out and look for it and you're just so adamant about it, they treat you like a sucker. Mm -hmm. Like, oh yeah, we see you coming from like a mile away. If Let me see. Right. Like, like you'll just take whatever. Just do what, to what you got to do. Be. Stay patient and trust the process. And just be in love with the grind. You got to, because you can't skip steps. Right. At all. So, man, just, hey, that process, man. And when you do for, you know, your city, for your community, for the kids, man, for the... shout out, I'm sorry to cut you off. Shout out to Haitian Jew. And let me, uh, you know, partner with them for Feed the People. They do it every other Sunday. Okay. Right? So, they get, we get all the food together. And we just go downtown and just hand out lunches. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Whatever. You know what I'm saying? And then I have, you know, I got kids. So my son play for basketball. So I coach and help, you know, just help the Jits out. Because I don't think anybody, nobody really does that these days. Like when I was coming up in Orlando, we had, we had specific people that you know, like even if it was from the hood, like I can go talk to them. They're gonna, they not going to tell me the wrong thing. Now I just think it's a free fall. Mm -hmm. And ain't nobody it's saying nothing. Don't yeah. Don't so, you know, I don't think we have anybody like that no more. So, once again, shout out to Haitian Chew for that. We feeding the people every other Sunday, um, every month. It's a whole movement. Um, and then just, I'm just, hey, whenever I see somebody need help, it ain't got to be, no, yeah, we, it ain't got to be no specific thing. It ain't got to be always big. And they always got to be on camera and nothing like that. But, you know, we just try and fit in where we can. All right. Yeah. Do you see yourself in the future maybe 
starting some movement of your own, even with the movement you already have going to help your community to put two things together. Yeah, I want to be honest, I really want to start like, I want to work with the kids. Right. Because really, that's who that's who needed. We mm -hmm. grown, we, you know, we out of the way. Yeah, we going to make it. Yeah, we out of the way. But like the chicks coming up, you know, 16, 17, 18, 19, mm -hmm. they the ones who really got either a lot to gain or a lot to lose. Correct. You see what I'm saying? And so where I may have had a pitfall, they don't have to go do the same thing. Correct. You feel me? And, you know, just probably starting something for the kids, to be honest, and the youth, right. you know, young adults. Because I'm not too far off from that. I'm not too far from, removed from that. So you see what I'm saying? Right. Right. Same world. Right. Same so world. So I get the it. platform that you right. have to there you go. I get it. So that's probably like the biggest thing. And we'll probably start that soon. Just something. You know, me and my team and get together. And yeah, we're so really going to put something. We're going to be coming back in a couple months. You know, start playing right. now. Design together some back to school there you stuff. Go. Kids always need back to school always. stuff. Always. And I did a back. Me and a trigger. Contraband. We did a, a back to school event last year at the fairgrounds. We had State Farm involved. Um, we had some local businesses, and we I think we gave away a thousand backpacks with supplies in it. Yeah, and had like a little concert out there. That's nice. Yeah, so it was you know it was pretty hard. That was something really nice for the kids. Right. Help out. You know, we, we do what we can. Yeah, yeah, we do what we can. We ain't really got no stamp on it though. That's just something we did. Right. You see what I'm saying? Wait, next time we'll probably have a stamp for it. That's you will. Right. Keep keep doing what you're doing. People will hear you, they're gonna see you and they're gonna like you said, they're gonna trust the process. The process, man. So you're gonna go a long way. Right, appreciate that. Yeah, great. Uh, thank you for stepping in with us at Intervision TV. Oh uh, man, I appreciate the interview. Hey, shout out to IV TV, man. Salute. And last thing before we go social media where Man, they reach you, find you can reach me at moneyback underscore riley r-i-l-e-y um man just check out like all my instagram i got pretty much everything on it shows coming up music i'm putting out all of that so moneyback underscore riley man get at me